Every spring and fall season, Pokemon releases these new collector's chests with a couple of booster packs inside and some promos. And today, we're opening up the newest one for fall 2022, which features Dialga and Palkia on the cover. And we're also opening up some Silver Tempest as well. So buckle up, grab a snack, and let's bust these tins open to see exactly what's inside. And we're also gonna be giving away the promos too, so stay tuned for that giveaway. So here's a look at the collector's chest for fall 2022. We got the origin form Dialga and the origin form Palkia, and it has a bunch of stuff inside as you guys can see it has a little teaser of everything that's included this is definitely a fun kind of product to buy to give as a gift it's about 26 canadian dollars which could probably be like 22 us and i picked these up from the friends over at manta trading so if you guys want to shop with manta you can use code sneaker talk tcg to get five percent off so we didn't just buy one we bought two for today because i wanted to see you know how good the pull rates are maybe we get an unlucky one so you know it doesn't hurt to, to buy two of these and also i get to spend more time hanging out with you guys so that said, let's open this up and oh, it's upside down. Here are the promos. Now these promos are pretty cool. Uh, these are all like common or uncommon cards in the set uh, that they're from. I think they're all from Brilliant Stars or Astral Radiance. You also get a uh, origin form Dialga coin right here. So I'm not sure if this is a coin that you get in every single tin, but I think this is the same coin you get if you get the uh, Dialga box. I'm not too sure, but there are Dialga and Palkia V-Star boxes. So if you guys missed out on those, check them out. Here's your look at the Hisuian Voltorb. We'll get some zoom in action right there. Pretty nice. It has a really nice hollow foil pattern on it too. And uh, yeah, the only way you can get these cards is by buying these specific tins. Of course, you can't pull a hollow rare common card, but this is a promo, even though uh, there is no promo stamp. This is just the same art from the set and everything. We also got Hisui and Growlithe as well. And this is the, like the foil pattern. I think you can get like those cool swirls on if I'm not mistaken. So we got Hisui and Growlithe here too. We got Hisui and Sneasel as well. So if you want to answer the comment question of the day, all you have to do is comment down below which three of these promo cards is your favorite or are your favorites. Mine would have to be the Hisuian Growlithe. I love Arcanine and Growlithe. So the fact that they have an alternate version of Growlithe is really cool. And uh, yeah, one person in the comment section will be getting all three of these promo cards and your comment will also you enter in the November giveaway for a Silver Tempest Elite Trainer Box that Manta Trading is providing us for this month. So huge shout out again to Manta if you guys want to buy any Pokemon cards at all, check out mantatrading.com and use code SNEAKERTALKTCG to get 5% off. I actually was there earlier this evening on Friday night and I almost won the weekly Pokemon card tournament. There was about 37 people who showed up and I made it to the very last round at the top tables. So if I won that game, I would have won the full tournament, but because I lost, I ended up tying for fifth to sixth place. So uh, yeah, I, I built my deck on the bus ride over. Right. So I had, I, it was crazy, I even made it that far. Now there are a couple other goodies they do include with this box. We got some stickers. And so yeah, if you're like a kid or you have a kid, these kind of like products are super ideal for children because who, who didn't like stickers growing up? We got some Palkia, some Dialga stickers. We got like two of those, uh, which is pretty cool. Here's a look at the uh, the Hisuian Pokemon I just showed you guys in sticker form. So we have two of those as well, which is nice. And then this is one thing I really like that they include. Before it used to be like these notepads, which I would always use, but now instead of notepads, they actually give you something which I think is honestly a bit cooler. They're, they're like notebooks. They're like little Pokemon notebooks. So. You can write whatever you want in here, keep track of certain stuff. It's, it's really cool, you know, it's practical items like this that are Pokemon branded that I really, really uh, like. So yeah, you can always put those stickers that you get in the book too. Last but not least, you get a mini binder or a mini portfolio as they're called. And uh, essentially, it's just a binder that holds like a single card on each of these sides. So if you wanted to put, you know, maybe you have a small amount of cards you want to bring with you somewhere, it's really handy to uh, just throw them in here and you're good to go. And then flipping it around, you got those Hisuian Pokemon on the back. And of course you get a code card that will give you these three promo cards or these three hollow versions of these cards in the online game. And we're gonna save the code card, enter the giveaway, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. One person will get one of these, all three of these promos actually. And then you're also entered into the ETB. Uh, giveaway. So here we have it. These are the five packs that they have included. We have one pack of Astral Radiance, one pack of Fusion Strike, actually two packs of Astral Radiance, one pack of Fusion Strike, and two packs of Silver Tempest. And if you haven't heard, I think Fusion Strike is going out of print, but they've printed so much Fusion Strike, so it doesn't really make a difference, honestly. Let's bust open these first five packs of the, uh, of the first 10. 
and then we're gonna open up the Silver Tempest packs and then the other tin right after. But yeah, hope you guys are doing well. I know uh, with Black Friday uh, just happening right now as I film this, there's a lot of temptation to spend money, but if you're able to save some money, there's some really good sets coming out in uh, in January next year with Crown Zenith, and then I think February we're gonna see the first uh, Scarlet and Violet sets. So I'm looking forward to see uh, what kind of stuff we get, we're gonna get out of those and what kind of cards are gonna come out of those sets. All right, we got a Sweet Honey and a Beedrill V. Hey, not bad, not bad at all. To start off with some first pack magic, we got the Beedrill V. Also, we can say this is gonna be like a little pack battle if you want, but we're not gonna keep track of like hits each pack kind of thing. We'll just show you guys the overall hits for each of the um, for each of the tins, and you guys can you know pick pick a tin to cheer for, tin one or tin two. All right, we got Cricket Tune, Bisharp, Stantler. Yanma, Hoot Hoot, Cricket Sat, Sudowoodo, Ooh, Radiant Halucha, and a Hasuian Avalog. So, so far so good. We got a hit out of each of the uh, packs so far. I am quite content with that. Let's see what we can get out of Fusion Strike up next. And uh, man, I'm so excited for Japan. I finally locked in all the hotels I'm gonna be staying at, or capsule hotels I'm gonna be staying at in, uh, in Japan. And I took an L because I kind of procrastinated a little bit on uh, booking the hotels, and because it took that two, I took those two to three extra days to book. I ended up spending an extra like two hundred dollars uh, on hotels and stuff, so Bruh. it's a little painful. All right, so we got a non-holo there. We got the Vika Volt, and now we got two packs of Silver Tempest inside. And I'm hoping we can pull one more Lugia alt art. That would be crazy. But if you guys missed it, I have the biggest luck in the world when it comes to Silver Tempest. It's probably my favorite set now, just because I pulled two alt art Lugias, and one of them was from a god pack. Um, so if you missed out on any of the Silver Tempest uploads on the channel, absolutely uh, check out the playlist. I'll leave a link down below, and maybe there's a video you're going to want to check out. But Silver Tempest has been amazing for me for pulls. We got a Glalie and a... Ooh, a hollow rare Reuniculus. All right, we go. Last pack for that tin. And uh, so far we're getting pretty good stuff, honestly. This is, if I were to like just buy this tin and, and get these pulls, I'd be quite happy. But we got one pack left for the very first chest. The first chest, the collector's chest. We got Primadora Altar, Sunflora, Claydol, Spinda, Pikachu, Noibat, Togedemaru, Sandile. Ooh, that is really nice. That is so cool, I love that. We've got the Trainer Gallery. Altaria, what a beautiful trainer gallery card. And a Caldeo non holo All right, so for our first pull recap of the chest, we got pretty good stuff, I gotta say. We got a couple holo, we got the hollows, we got the trainer gallery, a V, a radiant, like this is, this is a chest you are not gonna be disappointed with in terms of the stuff that we got just now. Very happy with that first chest. Next up, let's open up the two Silver Tempest booster packs. I just bought these today um, while I was at Manta because uh, I felt good after after my performance today. Man, I could have won. I was this close to winning another Pokemon card, my second Pokemon card tournament. And uh, it was with the Zacian V Union deck and I was building it on the way there, on the bus ride there. So it would have been just so crazy if I had won. I had zero practice with the deck too. It was my first time playing those cards. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna be going to a Pokemon $2,000 tournament tomorrow. And I've made some adjustments to the deck now, so hopefully I have even better luck tomorrow. Ooh, we got a Radiant Jirachi and a Zygarde. Yo, this Radiant Jirachi came clutch today at slowing down my opponent. And the only two decks I lost to against tonight were both Lugia. They were both Lugia V-Star decks. The very first Lugia deck I lost to, I just bricked. I couldn't get an energy for the life of me. Even on Intrepid Swords, I couldn't get a single energy. So I deserve to lose because I just got unlucky like that. And then the the other uh, other loss was neck and neck. It was such a close game against one of the top players in the store as well. Um, so yeah, if you guys want to see some Pokemon card tournament vlogs, I'll have the playlist. A lot more Pokemon tournament vlogs on the way soon too. All right, Snow Runt, Fletchling, Furrow Seed, Smeargull, Fungus, and hey, nice a Hyper Rare Candice, the Rainbow Rare Candice. That's pretty cool. That is dope. Candice is really good for those Palkia Curum decks. But uh, Palkia Kyurem decks aren't as popular these days because Lugia is just so strong. Pretty much all those players who love to play the best deck in the format, they switch from Palkia to Lugia because Lugia is just that much better. We beat one Lugia today and then we lost the two others. So I'm, I'm pretty, you know, I'm pretty happy. Can't necessarily complain with the results, especially playing a deck I've never practiced with. All right, moment of truth. Will it have the same Dialga coin or the Palkia coin? Let's find out. It is a 
upside down and a Dialga coin once again. Here's a look at everything. I'm just not gonna take it out. These will be the promos that I give away. Again, comment down below just which one of these promos are your favorite. Hit that like button and subscribe to the channel and I'll end the giveaway for these specific promos after this video hits 50 likes and 50 comments. Then I'll just pick a winner right there. So the first 50 people, you will get access to this giveaway. And for the code word of the day to get a free code card that gives you an online booster pack of Pokemon cards, include in your comment your favorite color. And the first people that include their favorite color in their comment will get a free, free code. All right, so here we go. These are the packs once again, the exact same packs. And I believe this should be the, the case. Every single time you buy one of these tins, they even show you like on the cover right here, is the, like the packs you're supposed to get. Actually, that's surprising. I guess not. It says there's supposed to be Lost Origin, like two Lost Origins in here, zero Lost Origin. Here it says two Lost Origin, two Astral and a Fusion. So they said no to the Lost Origin and they put Silver Tempest in instead. That is surprising. I'm, I'm quite surprised. And now I have a new YouTube title for this video that the, the, the collector's chest surprised me because I was expecting Lost Origin and not Silver Tempest. All right, I love it. I got some some built-in clickbait for the video, Bruh. even though it's not even clickbait. Like I was genuinely surprised they had Silver Tempest because Lost Origin was the advertised pack. So is it really clickbait? You can be the judge. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's see Fusion Strike. Can you bless us with some Mew Magic or some Battle VIP passes? I would not mind some Battle VIP passes. We got Onyx, Choodle, Shroomish, and a Golem non hollow Let's do Astral Radiance. We got one pack of each of the legendary, legendary almost like horse Pokemon when they have all the, the four legs like that. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, Astral Radiance. Let's see what we can get. We got a Dark Energy, Yen Mega, Gapejaw Bog, Magneton, Hisuian Sneasel, Mischievous, a Barboach, Scyther, Eevee, Ooh, a trainer gallery frost moth. Okay, pretty cool. Melanie. Melanie looking fine, girl. Hello, lady. And we got a ooh, a Garchomp V. Hey, nice. I love Garchomp. Garchomp's sick, and I've also been experimenting with like a Reggie Drago deck. And Garchomp with a zero retreat is kinda nice, not gonna lie. Let's get to the next Astral Radiance. That kind of makes up for the first pack having like nothing. Because we got two pulls from that one pack right there. And that's the one thing I honestly, I don't know about you guys, but I love the fact that trainer galleries allow for like some really crazy cool double banger booster packs. You feel me? Like the fact that we got the God pack with the Rayquaza VMAX and the Alt Art Lugia V, that's insane. Like the fact that you can have magical magical booster packs like that, it's kind of nice. All right, we got Feather Ball and a Reggie Ice non hollow. Shout out to LDF, he loves his Reggies. I honestly wouldn't be surprised if like LDF names his kid Reggie. <laughs> When he has a kid one day, he'll name his kid Reggie. And that's like actually not a bad bad name now that I think about, now that I think about it. All right, who am I to say who it's a good or bad name? I named my dog Misty and also LDF also named his dog Misty too, which is kind of crazy. We didn't even know each other, but then when he told me his dog name was Misty, I was like, yo, my dog's name is Misty too. All right, Spinarak, Frenikin, hey, Malotech, hey, there we go. Shadow Angelina, I know she's on the hunt for this. And we have... Hey, a Mawile V-Star, another double banger. You love to see it, that is sick. We got two booster packs in a row with double bangers. Yeah, this, this chest has been awesome. Silver Tempest, baby, let's do this thing. And then I'm gonna be opening up the Black Friday Charizard UPC that I purchased. I'm, I'm excited, man, I'm excited. All right, last pack magic. It is a good code card. I just saw the code card, I ruined it, but we are gonna get a holo card, so here we go. Last pack magic. Again, make sure you guys enter the comment question of the day. And uh, if you made it uh, to the end of the video, you know, I appreciate you. Thank you for, for sticking it out, hanging out with you, boy. To the end, Dratini, Candice, and a Ariados Hollow Rare. All right, click on screen right now to watch another Silver Tempest opening, and I'll catch you guys in one of those videos. Peace out.